Hey everybody, this is my 55 gallon Garami tank and today I just want to shoot a little quick tip. I know a lot of you know that I cover the tops of my tanks with cloth material. You can see there and there and you know I also hang that same cloth down in front of my tanks to cover up where the filters are being hidden but a lot of you may not know that I also use that very same cloth as a backing behind my aquariums. It's really inexpensive. Uh, it's really easy to apply. I literally just tape it to the back of the aquarium. I let it hang down in the back and it gives me a nice backing that's really easy to change and move around and I can change colors and do all sorts of things. The reason I'm even thinking about it was I was cleaning up in the other room and I came across this old piece of uh, cloth I had bought once upon a time and I had sort of what was a sort of starry night kind of themed tank and I had this cloth as the backdrop and it gives a little bit of the impression of a sort of starry night. It was the best I could come up with at the time. But I just go up to the uh, sewing department at the Walmart, or you can go anywhere that has a sewing department, the same place I buy the uh, batting material that I use in my filters. I also buy this cloth material, and it only costs a few dollars a yard. You get a huge variety of different cloths and colors and styles and textures. And again, I'll use simple black cloth to cover some of my tanks. And over here, we can see quite literally just tape. I've just got it taped across the back and then it hangs down. But once it's in the tank, it just gives you that sort of dark color. Now again, I go with the purple because purple's my thing. And once it gets in the tank and the light gets on there, uh, it doesn't come out quite as purple as you might think. And that purple actually gives you a little bit of a uh, sense of depth. It sort of looks like you're looking at a uh, you know, light off into the darkness, off into the depths of the water behind you, but it really is just that purple backing in there. So you could go with a midnight blue or a black or any kind of material you wanted, and it's just a really easy way to decorate your tank, and it's a really easy way to do it in such a way that you can change it up as often as you want for very, very little money. So there you go. That's all I've got time for today. I will leave you with one little look at my two... German Blue Rams that are still doing really well. I know this tank needs a little bit of work right now, but the Rams themselves are doing really well, and they still seem to be acting like a pair, so I'm happy about that. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. Make sure you're subscribed, and I will see you real soon on the next one.